What is up everyone? Andy Kruger here. In this video, I'm going to show you a very unique exercise on leash that's going to totally exhaust your dog in a matter of minutes. All your dog will need to know is a heel command and a command to go get their toy. Now, if your dog doesn't know a heel command, you got to watch my other videos and teach it. What are you doing? I'm going to be using a short leash, a flat collar, and his favorite toy, ball on a rope. If you want to substitute a harness for the flat collar, that's totally fine. This exercise is great because you don't need a ton of space, you don't need your dog to be off leash trained, and you don't need a ton of time. Let's do this. Freddie, OK. Yes. Woo! Freddie, OK. Ready, I see. Breath. Ready, OK. Yes. Double. Done. I see. Breath. Ready, OK. Yes. Now, why am I letting my dog pull me around? Well, why do people train with resistance bands? Why do they pull a weighted sled? It is a great exercise and it's going to get the job done with far less repetitions than without the tension on it. Like with Freddie here, I'd have to throw the ball a million times before he was exhausted. But if I put that back pressure on him and he drags to the ball, he's going to get a lot more tired a lot quicker. It is crucial your dog has a great heel command to do this exercise because remember heel means be on my left side. Heel doesn't mean we're walking forward. It means put your head on my hip no matter if I'm standing still, moving backwards, forwards, or to the side. Rest. Ready? Okay. Okay. Yes. Oh. Right, okay. Yes. Oh. This is also the perfect exercise to work on your retrieve. Your dog doesn't have to be the best in the world at bringing the ball back because he's on leash the whole time. I'm bringing him in nice and slow. And then by the time he gets the ball, it's very easy to encourage him to come right back to me. Done. I see. Rest. I toss the ball. I'm going to call him into heel. Freddie OPA. Yes. And I give him his reward marker. Yeah, yes, yes. And then he's right here. And I can grab that rope and play tug with him. Done. Freddie OPA. Okay. Okay. Yes. Yes. Done. Ready. Okay. Okay. Yes. Yes. So I hear a lot in the comments, Andy, what if I don't have a big fenced in yard like you? What if I have to take my dog to the park? He's unreliable off leash. Other dogs could run up at any point. This is the perfect exercise because all you need is a very small space. And if you are out in public, if you do see another dog off leash, hopefully not, but maybe coming your way, your dog's right here, your toy's right here. It's easy to put that away and get out of there. Yes. Okay. Okay. Yes. Okay. Okay. Yes. Ready. Okay. Okay. Yes. Woo! It's a 
like a boy. So as you can see, if your dog knows heel, sit, down, stay, very basic obedience, the sky's the limit with the possible variations you could do with this exercise. So give it a try. Let me know what you think in the comments. Hit my Patreon, patreon.com slash Andy Kruger. It is a monthly subscription-based website, but that's where I put all my training videos, full length, unedited, behind the scenes, step-by-step -step stuff that you cannot see anywhere else. So if you like what you see here, consider the Patreon. Until next time, happy training, y'all.